here we are with the Asus NVIDIA GeForce GTX 670 and we're about to install it in my HP computer. Right now you can see that I did not take the bottom plate off because it is uh, best to be there until you're going to install and then you take it off. And the other thing is to take off this plastic wrap that is on the back because it will melt right to the graphics card. So right now I will be putting it into my desktop. Take off this panel or this plastic. So right here we have where the PCI connector is and we're going to slide it right in, in between there and there. Some. Maybe a tight fit, but I'm sure it will fit. <laughs> it may fit. Okay, I'll take out a couple cords here so I can fit it in nicely. Easily done, and uh, we'll solder in now. Don't touch any of the PCI connectors because you may damage them with your finger or oil. Closest as you can, and in. Closest as you can. Everything is down, it looks like it's in place, so we'll reconnect these cords. Make sure they snap in tightly. And the four pin. Don't damage any of the plates. So it went in tightly. Now we need for the power supply to the graphics card. You see these two blocks here that are six pin um, power supply. And I have right here a six pin power supply and another six pin. So I plug those two in right there. So the first one, this one goes on the second side. In. And this one goes on the first one. Plugged. Plugged in tightly. Good. And they click. So you need to make sure you hear a click. So I am going to tighten in this bracket. This bracket right here. This connection. Uh, is this on the outside? Side. Uh, I think it's on the outside. Yeah, it goes on the outside. So make sure both graphic card and the Wi Fi are connected in correctly. There we go, perfect. In tightly, and this one is in tightly, perfectly. There we go, and uh, tighten it up with your screw. So it does not move or adjust at any time. strong in there. That should be everything for the graphics card. Well, it's tightly in there. Let's make sure that there's nothing touching the fans. Okay. Nothing is getting in the way of the fans. They are sort of touching right there. So I may need to move 
Yeah. I'm going to move the power supply to the motherboard up one because you don't want it touching and the PC up. Um, I'm going to take this off now. Processor through first. Make sure it runs nice and smoothly, it doesn't get caught up on anything. Okay, and now I'm going to put the power supply down and under. And do the same, make sure it doesn't hook up on anything or, or get stuck. There we go. Perfect. That will keep the cords from hitting the fans. Let's take this twist die off. We'll have to move these twist ties after. To position them properly. Put that over there. There. And position this to go back. Oh, put that fork on in there. Click. There we go, and now the four prong for the processor will go back in. Click, yep. And that should be everything actually. That should be all. And uh, if you see this on the website, you'll know that it's running. YouTube website. So hopefully we get this all set up properly. And uh, yeah, that's good. Good job from me and from my mom's uh, recording of the site or the computer installments. Um, and uh, maybe if you need any advice or something, it'll be in the links below. Subscribe, like like this video. So uh, that'll be it. Thank you and enjoy.